Hello, veteran 012 in here. Welcome back. This is another episode of Dragon Quest 7. In the last episode, I showed off the first bonus dungeon. We defeated God. And I off screen killing God a few more times. Uh, I got the hero heart for Gabo just to compare stats with the uh, the Rainhawk. I actually get more agility with the Rainhawk and not much gain in all the other stats, so I decided that Gabo is going to stay a Rainhawk. There's really no reason for me to, uh, to change him to a hero, other than to maybe learn the skills of a hero, but I don't really need to. So I'm going to skip it. Alright, so let's plop these things down here, and look at this. What does that spell? Dragon Warrior 7, huh? How about that? Oh man, oh, this will be easy. This guy won't be a problem. Yeah, pretty much a joke now. Once upon a time, those doors boxes are pretty fucking dangerous. I don't know, I think I've shown off a Platinum King before, haven't I? I don't remember. No, maybe not. <laughs> it ran. Yeah, I don't know if Platinum Kings actually give uh, experience like like uh, like Metal King slimes. I don't know if it's a lot. It might be. I don't really care. I mean, once you get the Platinum King heart from the Metal King Castle, you don't really need to, you know, try to kill those guys for monster art. Oh, unless you want more than one character with heal us all, but... I don't know. I don't really see the purpose in that. It's really not needed. Oh, now we're fighting mad plants.
Ooh, a dark mage. About to be a dead mage. Making up? Huh? Okay, I don't, I don't know what's going on there, but okay. Yeah, that Hellhawk. We gotta kill him. Bye, Hellhawk. XP. And we get a goddess ring. This accessory right here will make it so you, uh, yeah, you'll heal magic points while walking. Eh, it's okay, I guess. Ah, fire is bad. Five, holy cow, that's a lot. Not used to that. Another Platinum King that I probably won't kill. Wow, that was, uh, that was pretty cheap. Die, you bitches. I don't know if we can get sap on this guy. I'm gonna try it. Oh, we got him. Hooray. Ooh, look at that. I guess you can get ex experience for fighting those guys. Holy crap. That's about double what a fucking Metal King Slime gives. So 
I, I guess if you can get your attack up high enough, you can pretty much uh, get those uh, Platinum Kings pretty easily. Yeah, because they have really high defense. Really high defense. Like, when I made Gabble a Platinum King, his defense skyrocketed. Like, his natural guard. I was actually thinking about keeping him on Platinum King, but all the other stats suffered, so I was like, nah, I'm not going to do that. The, a Destruct Shield. Oh, it's cursed. Yeah, don't use it. Open chest. I didn't think I'd still be gaining levels here. Another tiny metal. Hooray. Not that I give a shit. Ooh. Night Kings. Wait a minute. You guys ain't no Night Kings. You don't look like the Night Kings I know. You ain't no White Walkers. Decent experience. Oh, the filet, by the way, one of those prizes you can get for beating God in 19 turns or less. Uh, that is, um, that's supposedly an item that uh, is like the ultimate item for monster taming, I guess. Not that I think I really care, but hey, whatever, man. Oh, wait, no, I don't want to do, I don't want to do Hell Flame. No, I want to do Giga Slash. No, buddy, just attack. Wow, more levels. Here you go, Gabo. One chest. And in this chest, we get the Echo Hat, which is one of the best uh, helmets in the game. 
what this does, it makes it so you cast two spells in a row, which is kind of good. Which is kind of good. So if you don't have like heal us all, uh, and you just have like heal us, you cast uh, two heal uses basically in a row with this uh, with this helmet. I don't think I care to use this. I don't know. Hold on a second here. Let me. Uh, Let me try something. I'm thinking it only works for spells. But I might be wrong about that. Let's see if it works for... S Wait. No, dude. Equip it. Wait a minute. I, I can't equip it. Boo! Who can use this? I wasn't even paying attention to that. Melvin can use it. Gavel, can you? Oh man. Boo! You guys can't use it? Well, let's see if it works with uh, Giga Slash. Let's see if he uses it twice. Oh, that's handy. This might be a good floor to level up right here. Yeah, let's see if Giga Slash can be done twice. <laughs> Cannot. So yeah, you know what? I don't don't really need the echo hat. Cause I don't really need to cast two spells in a row. Yeah, I think we're good to go, man. Let's do it. I think we're getting pretty close to where we need to go here. Wait a minute. Great merms. Die, Grocko spawn. It's uh, the N Death Pal area, isn't it? Same area we fought Death Pal. A long time ago when we first met Gabo. Ah, yeah, such a long time ago. And here we are. Yeah, at this point, we're going to be facing a boss. I don't think this boss battle is going to going to be uh, as hard as uh, God was. I mean, God's pretty easy as long as you're leveled up enough and got the, uh, the right equipment. But look, it's a Terra Spirit. And the Wind Skank. Hi, we can't let you go any further, cutie. Yeah, so we gotta fight the spirits. The spirits are against us. I don't think fighting against you is pointless. All right. 
right, so... Yeah, these guys are supposed to be our, our friends. What's going on with that, huh? Yeah, these guys... Shouldn't be too bad. Oh, now you're throwing rocks at us. Oh. Alright, so... What we want to do... To start this out is we actually want to take out the Aqua Spirit first because... Uh, that's the, basically the, uh, the healer for their party. So let's take her out first. Let's have Melvin use... Barrier. Let's have Gabo do something here. Uh, don't I have like a? See, I always get confused in this game. What abilities are which? So we got upper increase, and didn't I have like a, I don't even know anymore. Whatever, I'm just going to do heal us all. Pretty weak damage. That is still pretty weak. Better, but still pretty weak. Magic wall, that's the one I need. Uh, Gabo, you just do white fire, buddy. Actually, better yet, better yet, Big Bang, what the hell am I saying? Big Bang. Yeah. I don't think it's gonna, yeah, it's not gonna hurt the fire spirit, though. That's alright. Does good damage to the other ones. Oh, you bitch. Well, so much for uh, magic effects. Alright, that's fine. You wanna do icy pulse on us? We will show you no mercy. No mercy, you are dead. You are dead. All of you are dead. Yeah, Aqua Spirit's gone. Now I think we want to probably focus on the, uh, the Terra Spirit, although I don't think it really matters at this point. Thank you. 
Yeah, we're just gonna do sword dance from now on. Melvin. Uh, no, don't don't do Hell Flame. Just do Giga Slash on him and Big Bang. Pretty weak. Uh oh. That's really weak. None of Gabo stuff is gonna work on uh, on the fla on the uh, the flame spirit. That's all right. Doesn't matter. These guys are toast. Done that. Should show something else for Gabo. Yeah. Look at that, another level. Not that I care. But yeah, I notice uh, with these later levels, I mean, the stat increases are pretty incredible. Ah, the power to grow. So yeah, we have endless potential. And we got nothing to say about fighting those spirits just now? What the frick, man? So, uh... What's this? Oh, hey, it's God! Hey, God, what's going on? What are you doing here? Wow, you're just everywhere, aren't you? See, I could send this guy to the uh, to the immigrant town if I wanted to. Hey, all right. Anyways, like I was saying, you might be asking yourself, why in the hell? Would you care about uh, about sending God to the immigrant town? Well, you get to basically fight him as many times as you want without going through the the, uh, the first bonus dungeon. So let's go find God and say hi to him. Uh, my town should still be the Grand Cathedral, so he should feel uh, you know he should feel right at home. Um, 
That fish ball is actually closest. Yeah, where is he though? I'm not really sure. I imagine in each immigrant town he's gonna probably show up in different areas, obviously. Kinda goes without saying, but say it anyway. Oh man, where the hell is he? There he is. There's old Tubby. So yeah, you can fight him and get those prizes again and shit if you want. Uh, the bonus content for this game leaves a lot to be desired. Um, the bonus content for other Dragon Quest games are much, much better. I I'd have to say, yeah, definitely the bonus content for this game is pretty weak. I mean, really, God? I mean, what's the purpose of fighting him? There's really no purpose other than, you know, I guess, you know, if you want to beat, if you like beating the crap out of God, then that's really, that's really the only purpose. But, um... Oh well, that is all for this Let's Play of Dragon Quest VII. I hope you enjoyed it, and if I do do if I do do another LP of Dragon Quest game, it'll be Dragon Quest VI probably. Uh, Dragon Quest XI will eventually come out, and I'll hopefully get that someday and record that. That should be cool. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Again, thank you for watching, and have a nice life. Bye-bye.